All right, YouTube, I done got sealing all on my hands. This is Halloween. I made a Halloween costume, and um, I had to make some guts. I cut myself in half, and I've been having problems with this sealing. I got this sealant, and it's just dried up, caked up, sarred. What's been working with me so far, what I've been using, I've been using a razor blade, which is very dangerous, and I don't respect nobody to use it, and I've been chipping away. You know, slowly but chipping away. Let's see if I could um hold this and show it to y'all at the same time. Let's see. Okay. So what I did was like chip at it, you know. And it comes off, but it's hard as heck. This will take your time. You can get it off, like... You know, but you worsen you you having a real effect of hurting yourself. You gotta be very slow about it. This is nothing you can do fast. You just gotta take your time and chip away at it. I try not to use a sharp spot because I don't want to cut myself. So I use this end, this end, because you're gonna cut yourself if you do it any other way. Because this stuff is close to your skin, and why take the chances of a cutting yourself when you don't have to now I'm going to try something else different because I know isotone chemicals and stuff I don't want to use so my idea is to soak it right quick get it wet and as it gets soaked I'm going to use some soap I got some soap Try to wash some of it, suck it down. Then I'm gonna take this brittle pad, this brittle pad, and go through. This is the quickest way, but you gotta do it slowly. But the brittle pad is working. What I notice, wet it down and brittle pad. Let's see if we take some of this stuff off my fingers right here for you. Uh, yep, it's going off. But you see, you gotta take your time. I'm rushing. I shouldn't be rushing like this because this brittle pad you can cut your skin. You can make you raw. Right here, let's do this. You see that? Everybody see that? This is a good one. White. Everybody see that? Something. Let's see if we have to take this off. Wet it. Go through it. It's like taking it off by layers. Got a thick piece of sealing. But it's coming off. It's coming off. This is what it's going to look like I'm going to have to do tonight. I'll be doing this tonight. Ah. Getting all this stuff off my hands. But it was a good Halloween. I'll show y'all a picture of it later. That's what you want to do. This is the what I found so far that's gonna work. If you got more time and you better at it, you can take a razor blade and go at it, pick it up. If this label like this chunk like this, all chunked out, then you can take the chunk off, you know. This is how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it the razor blade, show you how I do it. You gotta be easy with it, gentle. I'm still rushing it. I shouldn't even be rushing it for y'all like this. But I'm just want to, for the camera, to show y'all what it can do to take this these big chunks out. Look at that big chunk. But it's stuck to your skin. Let's see, you go up underneath it, pick it up, push it, go up underneath it. But this is dangerous. I do not recommend it. I recommend using this end of it. That way you can just... And it's not good to wait till it dries up. My butt let it stay on there and threw some blood and paint on there to make it look like blood. It scared everybody. But at the end, I got to come home and take all of it off. And that is hard. But for those who need help, this is what you do. Take it off. If you want a quick fix... Use the steel wool, some soap. 
Pomidon. Use the soap. Keep your hands wet. And then wring it out. Be slow with it. Don't rush. The slower the better. But I know like y'all. See how it takes it off. Like it's coming off. It's coming off. Well, I hope this helps you out. Good luck to take sealing out your um, hands or off your body once it's sun cured. Now, still wool and some soap is my recommendation for you professionals who want to sit here and pick at your skin with the razor blade. That's the next best thing. They say it's soaking in isotone and all that, but I'm not going to soak my hands in cancerous chemicals. I'm not going to soak my hands in chemicals that's going to eat up my skin while I can do it the way I'm supposed to do it. I would try some Vaseline. I should try Vaseline and do this tomorrow night. But I'm going to soak it. And if I can't get all this up tonight, I get tired taking this off. I'll soak it in some Vaseline petroleum and do a video on that, I guess. But this is a problem. We need to get this fixed. Look at that. Look at that. That's just stuck. Ugh. We gotta come out. That shit pulling out. Like I ain't got no hair. This is what it looked like. Spray foam hard in the mug. Whoever comes up with a cleaner is gonna get paid. <laughs>